Hello friends, uh, today I will discuss about restricted armor delay low impedance type. So here I will discuss about restricted armor delay first side of the transformer. So why restricted armor delay is used? So restricted means for a particularly zone. So here the neutral city and the base city or the bushing city uh, which form the particularly restricted zone a part for art for docker within this zone then only this relay will detect and send a trip signal to the circuit breaker so first i will discuss about uh, what are the advantages of high impedance type and when we cannot use actually high impedance type restricted art for relay so in this diagram uh, for the star side of the winding uh, restricted art for type uh, high impedance type relay has, connection has been shown so formation is simple that is all the phase city or boosting city whichever is taken for the formation of the restricted earth point relay uh, that is p1 uh, is connected towards the bus side and p2 is connected towards the uh, transformer side for all the uh, base cities if it is taken from the base city and if it is taken from the boosting city p2 shall be towards transformer side for all the phases Again, for the neutral city, P1 shall be connected towards the earth side and P2 shall be connected towards the uh, neutral side. And for the secondary side, uh, formation is very simple. There is S1 of the neutral city is connected together that of the S1 of the all the phase cities. Here you can see S1 of the red, yellow and blue phase are sorted together and that is also sorted together to the N city S1 and uh, one terminal is formed again uh, s2 terminal of all the bushing city and the neutral city are sorted together and another terminal is uh, formed and this two terminal taken by means of cable to the control and relay panel and it is connected to the restricted earth fault relay that is 64 so one impedance is high impedance is connected in series with the relay and that is why it is called high impedance relay and function of the high impedance is in order to prevent uh, tripping or prevent st uh, uh, provide stability during through fault condition if any of the either of the NCT or phase city or bushing city saturate. Since high impedance is uh, connected in series with the relay, a voltage spike may occur during internal fault condition. So in order to avoid uh, for this voltage spike and prevent damage to the relay, a metro seal is connected across the uh, relay and uh, resistance combination. So what are the condition? That is the phase, all the city ratio should be same with that of the N city. So if uh, uh, the phase city or bushing city ratio with that of the N city ratio is not same, we cannot use the high impedance type restricted earth fault relay. In that case, we have to use low impedance type restricted earth fault relay. So here the connection of the low impedance type restricted earth fault relay has been shown in this figure. Here the N C T ratio is not same with that of the uh, boosting C T or base C T ratio. So here the connection is very simple. That is. Uh, all the S1 terminal, S1 terminal, uh, this is the S1 terminal of red phase, yellow phase and blue phase are taken uh, respectively uh, to the uh, red phase, yellow phase and blue phase coil of the relay and the another terminal are sorted together uh, to form the neutral and it is taken back to the CTJB. Here star formation is done in the CTJB. Uh, and for n series secondary that is uh, s1 is taken to the uh, neutral coil of the relay and another terminal is taken back to the s2 terminal so the connection is very simple here uh, no such uh, high impedance is required and also the requirement of metro cell is uh, not there so what is the main advantage of the low impedance type restricted earth fault delay? That is the connection diagram is very simple. Uh, requirement of metro seal is not there. And there is no such calculation for the what are the uh, resistance which is set at what values. So this is the restricted earth fault delay low impedance type. Now I will discuss about operating principle of the low impedance type restricted earth fault delay.
So the operating principle of the low impedance uh, type restricted earth fault is based on the differential current and the bias current. So here the I differential current is equal to sum of the vector sum of the three phase current that is Ia plus Ig plus Ic plus K into In. So all the uh, phase quantity are in uh, vector quantity and K is the uh, K is the uh, factor which is equal to neutral CT ratio divided by line CT ratio. So what is the purpose? So this value are in the secondary value that is I A I B plus I C I C are the value of secondary side of the current and I N I N is also the secondary side of the neutral city current. So if we multiply this secondary value of the neutral city current with the K factor, it will first convert the primary value of the current in the NCT and then if we divide it by line CT ratio then it will uh, convert uh, this current uh, to the ratio which is equal to the same scale which is the CT secondary side of the all the phase CT current. So this K factor comes all the neutral CT in the same ratio okay. So for example during normal current uh, this Ia plus Ib plus Ic is equal to 0 and since all the current is balanced there will be no neutral current then In is equal to 0. So during normal load condition I differential current is 0. And what is the bias current? Bias current is equal to half of maximum of uh, any phase current plus K into In. Okay. So whatever be the maximum of the current of any phase plus K factor into In. Again, it is uh, In is converted to the same ratio that is uh, for the all the phase space current. So this is the bias current uh, and the K factor. K factor is allowable for the range 0 0.05 less than K less than 15 for standard cities. Okay. So here the characteristics for differential current and bias current has been shown. It is more likely uh, similar to whatever the differential relay. So here IS1 is the initial setting which is normally set as 10 percent of the rated current. If rated current is 1000 by 1, uh, so normally 100 ampere is set as IS1. And initial show for K1 is given. Uh, uh, up to 0 to 20 percent okay and is2 is2 is the uh, rated current is set as the rated current for example if it is a 33 by 11 kb transformer uh, 10 mb type then rated current in the lv side will be 525 ampere so normally it is uh, set at uh, 1 per unit or rated full load current okay then after that higher slope is given in order to provide the through fault stability if any of the CT saturate. So CT saturation is taken care of this fire slope and this region is provided in order to detect any fault uh, earth fault uh, under uh, in, inside zone or restricted zone. Okay. So this is the characteristics of the uh, restricted earth fault uh, relay low impedance type. So what are the advantages for low impedance type restricted earth fault relay? So there is no need for dedicated series uh, which was required for high impedance restricted earth fault relay. So as a result uh, CT cost is substantially reduced. Number two uh, which is more important that is the wiring diagram is very simple that is does not require any external resistance and there is no calculation which is required for what is the value of the resistance which is connected with the high impedance type REF relay or it is not required any matrices. So number three is uh, it provides internal CT ratio mismatch compensation uh, by the factor K which is introduced it can match CT ratios up to 1 is to 40 resulting flexibility in substation design and also reduced cost. So these are the advantages of low impedance type restricted or for protection relay.
so friends if you like my video then do subscribe my channel and also press bell button for notification of videos to be uploaded in future thank you for watching this video thank you